Hello everyone and welcome back to another week of Let's Play Covert Action. We may have discovered the secret whereabouts of the Mastermind. Are we getting close? I'm not going to go through that door because that's how we get out. I've spent so much effort getting here. Might as well take advantage of what I've got. Extra guards have been posted so we need to be careful. Here's one of those extra guards. Libyan Embassy. Not so sure they're directly involved because, let's face it, we have got the stars are definitely involved. Agent D. She's recruited in Paris. Agent D's a Marxist agent. Cat comes in again. Marxist action team is Leon Koch in Rome. That's the only Marxist involved. Union Corsair. Definitely an interesting trail of events. Wanting to avoid being caught here. Very exciting. Oh, my disguise has just suddenly foiled. Grenades are being thrown. I don't know what I did, but apparently I deserve being being discovered. That's okay, I'm carrying an Uzi. The spy in TF2 wishes he had an Uzi. Actually, yes and no, because revolvers are far better than the SMG. Okay, this is obviously the man. Oh, Ian Lorenz. The guy who stole the Peugeot is obviously the Leon Koch character. Gas grenades. Can we find something useful in the... In the, um... Floor safes, please. They have a safe house in London. That's brilliant. We can easily find Leon Kosk. Oh no, we don't need to, do we? Excellent. So far, so good as far as this particular raid goes. <clears throat> don't know how they discovered me. But the alarm has ended. It's now safe for me to just lurk around like I own the place. Exactly, that's what I do when I own places. I just shoot people if they're in the room. Don't mind me, I'm just randomly crouching. And then shooting. That's what I do, I own the place. Gosh. Just tell me the rank, he's an operative. I don't know what he's doing, but he's clearly... He's there, whatever he's doing. And we know from the master plan, the action plan that is there, find a floor plan. There are no operatives here. So this is not the home of the mastermind. Where is the mastermind? It's a good question. I'm sure we'll find out more about Leon Kosk when we get to him. But I want to know about the mastermind. Once again, the alarm has just gone off randomly. Well, at least we can access this machine. What about Olga Balder? Amsterdam! Ah, oh, you're trying to get in with my friends, are you? Because all the cool people are Dutch. It just seems to be that way. Like, I'm half Dutch. Most of my friends have got Dutch in them. But if you're not half Dutch, don't be disappointed. It really doesn't make any difference. It's just a status symbol. Fragmentation grenades! What useless floor saves are you? At least one of you told me Leon Kosh was involved. Oh, I suppose it's let's fly to Amsterdam. Visit my friends and capture a mastermind. All in a day's work, eh? Usually it takes two cases for me to get a mastermind. But once you, once you know, you know. As soon as you give me that name, and you tell me where you're from, I'm like, I know where I need to be. So let's make it happen, shall we? Not waste any time. And my mother has brought in food, which shall be eaten with gusto, once I've finished recording. I shall now attempt to leave Berlin, and go to the airport. 
We need to be in Amsterdam. Wow, look at everything in Amsterdam. <laughs> Mossad, PFO, MI6, Red Army, Union Cossack, Stasi, PIFA, Red Battalion, Mafia, Libya, direct action. Wow. Well, pick a pick a place, really. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go with Stasi. We know that the mastermind is here. That much we know. But we also know the Stasi are involved. So we'll use the Stasi to get to the mastermind. That's my plan. It's a rather basic looking lockpick, really. Look at that, how many doors for the entrance. Go over door number three. We know about the agent in Moscow, which is good because apparently something is going down in Moscow. Regrettably, a long password. But we'll do what we can. Bum cries out in pain from sitting down for 40 minutes straight now. <sighs> oh, well, we'll survive. Ian Lorenz? We know Ian Lorenz is involved. Sometimes the jump commands are a bit hard to remember. Because my delete key is bigger than normal key. So it's not quite as it should be. Bob Brown again. Well, this room's completely pointless. I can't get further left of this. I have to go down. And sure, I could photograph filing cabinets and get random names, but really, lag spoke. All I'm looking for is computers. Safe house in Prague. It's good to know. Gun down that Stasi man. Alright, more computers, that's good. Terminals, to be more accurate. NPT, man. Floor safe? That's very good to know. London, Belgrade, and Rome. We have Antoine Jones in London, Ian Lorenz, and Bobby Brown. Not Bob Brown, Bobby Brown. Kidnapping specialist. Well, Bobby Brown. Heart of Brown, come and sit down. This is a very badly laid out building. Oops. Bankrupt. That's what the password is. Stun grenades! Rejoice! At least we got the action team. Once we got that, the rest is... It's really the best thing I like to see in a floor safe, really. Oh, wait! It's... something... ran... It can't be bankrupt. No. Cancel that. Just need one more computer and it'll probably all fall into place, but... I don't want to just make stupid mistakes again, it's annoying. Alright, come on. One more letter and we can hunt down that mastermind. Hunt them down and destroy them. Like a small child or a dog or some woodland creature in a hunt. Using preferably foxes or some sort of fairy creature to kill another fairy creature. There's sort of symmetry in that. Is it home? Delete? Page up? No. End. End! It's the opposite of what it should be on my keyboard. Five. Moscow. Got a face. 
Faces are nice. They can help sometimes. We are running low on film though. Stars here are as involved as you can be. Now while this is technically a storage room in quotation marks, it's probably one of the better eateries I've actually seen. Like the tables are almost, tables and chairs are almost in like some sort of logical order. You know, it's sometimes a bit hard to ask this game to have the layouts actually making sense. But it almost does, this game. Regrettably, there's no more computer terminals. These letters are all we're gonna get. And I have no idea. Alright, get rid of the bankrupt idea. What else could it be? Um... I just don't know. I really don't know. And I need this address. I just don't have time to mess around. Find a photo that I can look at while I work it out. Alright. Something... R-A-N... Something P something something T. I give up. I don't know. Hmm. Transport. Woo! Oh. Oh, baby. Yes. Yes. Oh, I finally got it. How many people were staring at the screen, screaming for me to try and get it? I got it. My brain figured it out. The Stasi aren't happy, but I am. I am happy. For this mastermind, it's gonna get captured. Guards are peering through the windows, and so they should. But the mastermind is going down. Going down faster. Faster than something that's very fast. That is Zyrtec, how's that? Actually we don't need the camera, we don't need the camera. We need the gas mask and the gas grenades. Because look at that, there are lots of enemies. We don't want to mess around. Might as well get the letter. Well by all means, hand me out random pieces of information. Quickly grab the mastermind. Yeah, I will slightly arrest you. Now run. Run quickly. They're all gassed. Quickly plant some more remote controls. Not caring about the computer. Alright. Detonate. Oh, I forgot the button. F, F8 is detonate. Cool, everything is gassed. Get out of there. That's how you capture a mastermind in two easy steps. We accuse Ogre Balder of taking part in the plot. I know that you're the mastermind, lady. I ain't telling you nothing. The suspect responds. You got nothing on me, but then I'm gonna break down anyway unless the participants in the plot. So Abdul Merrick of the Libyan Embassy, so I was wrong, initiated the plan. Benzia said, contacted the parties of the Libyan Embassy in Prague. Ian Lorenz financed the operation. Antoine Jones kidnaps the enemy mastermind. Uh, Leon Koch uh, of Rome. Uh, Tales the Victims, uh, Bobby Brown is the kidnapper, and once again we have the mastermind under arrest. She's taken to the local jail. Excellent work, Max! Ogre Balder as a mastermind we've been tracking for years. This outfit should be out of commission for a long time to come. That's right, read it and weep. So who are we going to get, in what order? That's a good question. Well, no one else is in Amsterdam, so I give her credit that we weren't just going to bump into her accidentally. Well, there's a lot of people in London, a lot in Rome, and a lot in Prague, but we have to get these people in the right order, otherwise it's not going to work. We need to get Abdul Merrick first. That needs to happen pretty quickly. Then, uh, the contacting parties man, 
uh, and the financer, and the rest are sort of all like in any order. But we do need to go for London first. So Abdul Merrick is the person we're going to go for, leaving an embassy in London, making it happen. We're just going to go to London anyway, even if we don't know about what's going on. We don't know where they are, so surely the best option is to harass the Marxists again. <laughs> um, Libyan Embassy, right. Why not? Oh, as we walk to the car, a group of nasty looking thugs approach. Unsurprisingly, they're not happy that I arrested the mastermind. Oh well. Stop leaping around, Kilk. And that's all the enemies. One, one thug. Conclusive evidence that they came from the Stasi. Well, let's check our facts. Check the facts. Thugs at five o'clock in the morning. Well, to be fair, there is a kidnapper there. So, that's true. You know what, since they're asking for it, let's get him. So let's crack open the safes and everything and get these guys arrested, shall we? Yes, we have the tea. Antoine Jones. Not really getting anywhere as far as this particular corridor is concerned. It's literally just one room after the other of pointlessness. Sadly, because there were two people there, it wasn't possible for me to prevent the alarm from being activated. Oh well. We can at least find out more about said people. Oh, the stun grenade almost got me there, but... Fortunately, everything's okay. Put a booby trap grenade there, which means fortunately we're both stunned. Still a problem though. I've still got half stun left on my body. One shot. Well, that was very lucky. If it wasn't for that booby trap, I would have been dead. Oh, he met with Benzia said. Some Mr. Xavier is being abducted. So get out of there. I could have gone the short way. <laughs> oh well, that's what happens when you you do a whole bunch of videos in one go, isn't it? You lose track. If the stars Aiden in Rome, I think that's actually what we needed in the first place. I can't quite remember, but we're finding out more and more about this man. Hopefully sufficient to turn him to our cause. Hi. Oops. I accidentally maleed him to death, which meant I took a bullet hole. CIA agent's a double agent though, that's good to know. No wonder everyone was in London. That's who the thug was, it was the CIA agent. But he crawled away. Now my brain is saying deleted, but I don't think that quite works. Twenty-two rolls of film left, however. Not so bad. He sent a message to Leon Kosh. Once again, Bobby Brown's back. Marxists. Selected. The Stasi. So who do we want to get now? Geneva? 
All very helpful places to have. The more places we can track these Stasi down, the better. And I know what the password is, I just need to know what I'm looking for. Gas mask. Completely pointless. And we know about the double agent already. Thank you, Gab. Ian Lorenz. Let's just look up Ian Lorenz, shall we? I typed what I wanted, not the password. Oops. Well, that'll do it. <laughs> that'll do it nicely. Well, let's at least arrest the guy. Tragically, not enough information to turn him into a double agent. So what are we going to do about that? It's an excellent question, 99. And I believe that we are going to attempt to photograph a few more things before we make our escape. Belgrade, that's where we wanted the address. We need to be very careful here. We know about the double agent, we got that. What we wanted was incriminating evidence. Oh fine, we know he's involved. We accuse Antoine Jones of taking part in the plot. We know that your role was kidnapping the mastermind, and we know that you have very, very blonde hair. It's true. I ain't telling you nothing. But it isn't it true that you met with Ben Zier of the Libyan Embassy in Prague? How about Leon Koshk? Doesn't remember. It's all a bit sad, isn't it? Good job, Max. This Antoine Jones is a pretty important agent. This should put a serious dent in the operational capability. So let's quickly check out the data section and review our suspects. That's what we were attempting to do, find the address of the Libyan Embassy. Hence the Stasi. Hence the Stasi. But we'll see what we can do. What we can do is check the organizational summary. And it's true, we don't have the Libyan Embassy. But as I failed with the password anyway, yep, oops. Alright, so what we're going to quickly do is go to the crypto branch, sorry, the intelligence section, and accuse the local agent. He gives me no information, but he does give me score, and that's good. So now what we do is go to the Marxist safe house. We need that password. We need that address, rather. We need to arrest this man. And apologies for failing earlier, but we do need this information. And hey, it could give us give us some floor safes to photograph while we're at it. Not such a bad look. Geneva. PFO. I don't even see what that one was. Geneva. T. The Marxist office is in Rome. I think we actually do need a few Marxist places from memory. Sorry, I've just I had a little bit of chicken before this video and it's all coming back to me now. Sorry. Ah. Oh. Oh, I clicked away too quickly there. We're getting more and more information about this Abdul Merrick. Possibly enough to turn him into a double agent. I find stun grenades. Wu-Tang. Stun grenades. Bobby Brown. Bye. Bye. A B and a D. Is it abducted? Quite possibly. But I'll give it a little bit more passwordage just to be sure.
Helpful game. So, what can we do? We need to get this man. And I keep pushing the wrong buttons. It's very easy to get attached to using the arrow keys. That's what I'm used to. And I believe it is abducted, so we're going to test that theory. Access is confirmed. And now we are searching for the Libyan Embassy. They have a hideout in London. Now let's get out of here. And arrest that man quickly, confidently, and soon. Hopefully, we haven't lost too much time with this break-in. Leaping over the chairs, like a true action hero. It's just like in TF2, where they invented the rocket launcher before they invented stairs. So now we're going to leave, and go to the Libyan Embassy hideout. And break in. This guy's mine. It's been a big day in London. Arrested two agents so far. We're now going to arrest a third. Door two. And wow, what a nice room. Infinite information. We've determined his rank. We haven't actually yet tied the clues to the man yet though. But we're going to get very close. This is his HQ after all, so... There should be plenty of information on this guy. Plenty of dirt. Yeah. Stasi. Alright. It's an R. <coughs> Red Battalion. Getting more and more information about this man. He will be mine. Floor safe. Find a floor plan in the floor safe. Well, that's not so bad. Knowing where the man is, we can avoid his presence until I deem it necessary. Basically, until I've uh, dug up as much dirt as I can on him. There is a large number of floor safes here. That's very helpful to have, the Libyan Embassy Action Team. But also good to remember I need Prague, so I shall write that down. Just in case I don't already have Prague. Need to keep a careful eye on the film though. If I hadn't closed that door, that guy would have known I was here. They are... They do remain quite diligent about their doors. Helpful. Helpful to have. No one's gone into hiding yet, that's good. Alright, I need to start conserving my film. We do have the computers, however. I'll be able to get the Prague address. Oh, I said Plark. Excellent. Gotta photograph the toilet though. I do find it somewhat amusing how jumping stuns. It inflicts stun upon self for a few seconds. It's like, yes, I jump across the room, now I'm stunned! That's because I'm rather egotistical and I'm forced to look at myself going, Ooh, that was a lovely jump. The floor safe had nothing in it at all. That's horrible. Red Battalion. And they got three more shots left. Please give me something. I want to turn this man. Oh, I'm going to go right. There's always a good thing about heroes going right. We know this.
Hey, look! That's almost making sense. The two chairs are facing the desk. Wow. Now, is that reported? Bob Brown. We're about to find out. I'm going to say it is reported. Ching ching. And Prague is where we need to be. They didn't even pick me up doing that. That's great. And that's the rest of my film depleted. Hi. Don't mind me. Just arresting you. Ha! Ah. And there are two more computers here. Might as well use them. They can't get in. L. S. Not very informative. Um. Lasers. <laughs> no. I'm not gonna bother. Quickly slip out the building. That's right. We accuse Abdul Merrick of taking part in the plot. I ain't telling you nothing, the suspect responds. But isn't it true that you met with Benzia said of the liberal egregy and plague on August 1? Oh yeah, I guess I did. The political council has resolved to kidnap satellite expert Xavier Ryban. You have fi to find a suitable organization to carry out this mission. I plan to personally arrange the appropriate funding. Okay, but isn't it true you met with Ian Lorenz of the Stasi in Belgrade? But he doesn't remember that. Interesting. Good job, Max. This Abdul Merrick is a pretty important agent. This should put a serious dent in their operational capability. Okay. So what we're going to do is call it a video, and when we come back next week, more covert action.